Heavenly Chaos is the latest update to ACS which introduces a bunch of new modifiers and challenges like the ones that you see on my screen right now. In this series, you'll be watching me go through my very first gameplay with Heavenly Chaos Enable while on the highest difficulty setting, which is called Tribulation 9 difficulty. You'll also be able to see me learn how to navigate and think through these new obstacles and I'll be playing more casually while doing so. Thank you for clicking the video and I hope you enjoy the gameplay. There's a big trade area over here. But I'll have to find like a spot where it's nothing annoying. Yeah, no, I don't think they can get it that quickly. Like if there's a bigger patch of but Cinnabar, then I'll be able to get it. Oh, this guy's kinda moving. Ah, oh, more invaders. Like come on, dude. Wait, didn't you just eat a... What? Maybe I had to make acupuncture needles. I forgot about that. I've been forgetting a lot about the acupuncture needles lately. lately. So maybe my cultivator needs to have to increase their healing estimate. Alright. I can make this out of stone essence. Let's do that. Try to give it like a better tier than whatever we do. Let's check work. I want to make sure I have someone that's crafting and I don't. Let's have you craft. Yeah, that's the only disadvantage of not having your disciples, like, do one farm area at a time because you just don't know. It, it just doesn't feel like anything's getting complete until everything is done. Because, like, okay, this is halfway done. This is halfway done. This is halfway done. This hasn't even started yet, honestly. This is, like, barely started. This is cleared out, but, you know, it's just like, ah, I feel like everything's moving so slow. And then we got summer coming soon. So some of my disciples will need a lot of clothes. So I just need to get the core shaper honestly, like so bad. Nice, we got Angus gems, Serenity Soul gems. Like this is insane. Oh, okay, we got 51 minutes of state. Alright. Let's, uh, mine. Oh, nice. You got the crafting epiphany? That's great. Let's try to have an e spirit power order again and see if that helps out. I don't know. Oh, it says it's gonna recover this time. Maybe I didn't eat it, eat it actually because they have spirit power and hill powder at 11. Alright, let's have them equip this needle and see if it helps out. Oh, their inventory is full? Ah, the amber fruit. Alright, so it says 0 0.6 days and then we have this. Okay, it's still 0 0.6 days. So I think this is just based on like if they were to heal someone. Or maybe it was set once it started. I don't know. Uh, Alright, this guy's in need of help. I don't have room for mortals. You guys die too quickly. Ah, uh, did I get those blood talismans? No! I should have bought those blood talismans because we have summer. That would have actually really helped out. Oh, no. I have to like farm demon high clothes. That's gonna take forever. But this guy's adventure fly speed. How long does it take for him to get the melon copper tune? Yeah, uh, point five eight days is not bad. But like the fact that he's not a core shaper yet. It's hurting, man. It's really hurting. We're one third of the way there, though. So 
So I just gotta have them, you know, stay focused on it. Chief Fountain, Chief Fountain, Chief Fountain. 1,800. Let's get this bad boy up to 2,500. 77 mental state. Oh yeah, we're back up. We're at 80 mental state. Okay, they're moving. They're moving. Oh, I thought this was the Earth Disciple. It's not. It's the Nimbus Disciple. I forgot about that. I didn't need to get the Fire Essence Bars. I could have just given him anything. Ah, whatever. He doesn't have an Elemental Bonus yet. Maybe this is just a bad choice for a starting Disciple. Cause his name is Earth One. Look, these guys are all sprinkled around. Okay, he's almost done with the herb garden. Nice. This one is almost done. I like when the small ones start to get finished. At least that feels good. And then once this is finished, that's gonna be super nice as well. Then we have this, 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 and this. I prefer if this one was done because then I'll feel real good. Okay, we got a mortal visitor. Please don't be from a sec. Okay, you're normal. That means I don't have to take care of you. Nice. Did we finally do it? We're at Core Shaper? Well, this is not even a Core Shaper stage for Nimbus. That'd be sad. Let's see. Taiyi. Okay, Origin is indeed Core Shaper. And then after that, they have Tai Shi. But they have two stages too, so it's going to be a while. But the best thing is that once they're core shaper, we can probably easily farm some demon blood. Probably give us some rep, but it'll be worth it. Nice. We're a core shaper now. Let's see what we can get for cultivation speed. Okay, 30% cultivation speed. This is what I wanted. Let's uh, check this out. One hundred and thirty-one percent cultivation speed bonus. That is very lackluster. Oh, okay. Two hundred fifty-nine percent. This is like the comfortable amount that I like to have. Like 250% once we're there, that's great. All right, let's keep them on mind. I want to see like how quickly they go. Well, wow, how many disasters are happening in this thing? Oh, never mind. That was the notification about the disaster that was already happened. All right, cool. I'm like, I know I didn't just get three disasters that quickly. Has it not been 0 0.8 days? Spirit stone energy. Oh, every time he eats in a, a spirit stone, he, okay, let's turn it off. This guy can't even take a spirit stone, that's insane. All right. Then I also want to get this guy some adventure fly speed. So let's do that. Oh, I don't have the manual transcribe. I want him to get him spirit travel. Are you using tic-tac-toe? He should be using one of these other leisure stations since they are superior. Let's see how his mental state goes up. It's at 80 now, so he should start to cultivate soon. Because that's just the settings that I have. Nice. Let's see how much it goes up by. Okay, we're at 235 out of 36,000. Let's uh, burst this array. Okay, they got 1,000 pretty quickly. Yeah, I mean, it's not the fastest, but it's moving. 
Yeah, we're already at 10%. Yeah, this is nice. It would be nicer if I had the Divinity Mind Talisman. That was just... I should have been more careful about killing those animals. I was more worried about it. What is attacking the wall? Oh, this bull? Oh, come on, dude. Messing up my flow. Yeah, Nemesis is pretty expensive for a Core Shaper manual. I usually play it when I'm like already late game, so. Plus I have reduction in cultivation speed, so this is just insane. I wonder if he has Thought Shards that are reducing cultivation speed, because this is just... Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, he's mentally unstable, which is good. Alright, so in that round, he got 7,000. I think that took like a day. Ugh. Let's see, how long does Mount Copper Tomb take now? 0. 0.4 assist days. So if I did like four trips to Mount Carbertone, I would probably have enough to increase these guys' temperature tolerance. But that would uh that'll take like two days. Alright, let's do it. Things gotta be done. Can't let my disciples die, you know. Sadly, Mount Carbertone is the only place where I can like form Demon Beast hide. But I mean, I do have the talisman, the recipe for the Dark Armor talisman, so maybe I could do other places. But right now, this would just be the easiest. All right, we have a bunny and a frog, so we're going to keep it this way. Let's just kill this guy. Mount Carbertone is pretty easy. You just stay on one side, and then when they go to your side, you just jump over here like this. You get the Demon Beast. Sometimes they get stuck over here too, which is nice. Let's butcher them. Hopefully I got 50 stack. That would be really nice. Okay, 15 stack. That's exactly what I wish for for Christmas. Alright, so I got that. Let's see if any of these mortals have anything crazy on them. Like a dragon feces. No. Alright. So we just got 30, so that's enough for one set. So if we do four trips, then we should at least have enough for four sets. Well, 30 is like one and a half. So if we do four trips, we should have enough for five sets of uh, Beast Hyatt clothing. Yeah, yeah, I know summer is coming. I'm getting these hide for you guys. So for here, I want to make demon hide then shirt, and demon hide then pants. And then how many disciples I have? I have seven disciples that I kind of care about. So this is one set. That's two set. Three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, I guess I can do like eight just based on a normal sex size. All right, we're going over there again. Probably should get a spiritual traveling talisman at this point. Some serenity soul gems, that would be nice. Everything is just more difficult with one disciple. I don't know how people do this. Like, this is crazy. This setting is passing. I 
And again, I have the bunny and the frog because I didn't like pick up anything. So this is nice. If I can keep it like this, then this will be like smooth selling. Poor leaving serious. Poor Gen 3. Wow, this guy has recalling thought shard, I think. Because why is it regeneration 607? True chi recovery. Comprehension. Learning speed. Huh. That's insane. What's the spell level? 16 out of 35. That's cool. Maybe it has hairy music. No, I don't see it. Yeah. This guy has 607 regeneration. That's crazy. Alright, let's butcher these guys. Can we get a 50 stack from someone, please? Uh, 15 stack again. These guys are going to make it work really hard. I do have a tiger and a panda, which I don't know if they both are like very prone to temperature. So we'll see. Oh, I need my Ling Chi to actually make this stuff because Ling Chi got the crafting epiphany. I mean, yeah, so they can actually do crafting and tailoring and everything at 100 quality. So you will be the tailor. No doubt about that. I hope they don't die soon. Please don't die soon. Don't be like the others. Okay, 76 days. That's cool. And then you have like 100 days of lifespan left over. <coughs> Watch when they make this. Unless they fist the epiphany. That'd be crazy. I'm like, no. Alright, so the casket also included a law manual. That gives me the talisman. Okay. I have to wait for this guy to get back. So as you can see, this is 100% quality, and this guy doesn't have any special stats in terms of artistry because they have the crafting epiphany. Alright, let's see. What else was I going to do with this guy? Oh. Law manuals. Store this. Store this. And then equip this so that we can unlock the location. Oh, uh, this guy's inventory is super full. Let's see. Kind of want to keep the amber fruit though. I guess we don't need that many. Then let's equip this one. Which unlocks the divinity mind secret. If I can get that, then that would be super useful. Sadly, I messed it up by getting condemnation. I really should have had my mortars just fight it out. Especially the ones that died already. Okay, I search up shadow. Wow, the talisman. One attainment to learn some really good talismans for adventuring. Oh, the parting shadow is a talisman that comes with Primordial Assembly's Law. So I probably should have this guy transcribe Primordial Assembly's Law because I never know if I'll need it. Yeah, that would probably be the best thing to do. Right, I'm going to let him get his mental state up a little bit. Nice, we got Serenity Soul Gem too. So he has 65 mental state, and then if I equip this, then he's good. He has 95 mental state now. And his energy bar is halfway there, but it's okay. All right, let's transcribe Primordial Symbols Law now. I think it's moving faster. Day 26, Core Shaper. Uh... Whoa, why are you hurt? 
Situ Yushi. Oh, he stroke. Let's see. Okay. This guy has mindful dresser on, so he's already taking stuff. Mindful dresser is kind of annoying, even though it does help out too. But I don't want these guys like just taking things. So I'm going to turn it off. Especially you. I'm sorry, but you get nothing. I'm going to die soon. What can I say? So these are 100 quality demon high clothing. So they give really good temperature tolerance. So let's look at what this guy's new temperature tolerance will be. From negative 45 to 19. And now negative 86 to 63. So they'll be good. So I keep my bunny alive, which is super nice. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Feel free to leave a like or a comment to show your support, and I'll do my best to respond to them. I hope you were entertained or at least learned something, and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode.